Good evening, listeners. This is Ernest Chappell speaking. Tonight, Orson Welles and the Campbell Playhouse observe a Campbell tradition of long standing. They bring you Charles Dickens' well loved tale of Yuletide, A Christmas Carol. Four years ago, the makers of Campbell's soups went shopping for a Christmas present to give to all their friends. They found it in this story, Charles Dickens' embodiment of the very spirit of Christmas. And they chose well, because throughout the country today, in thousands of homes, it has become an important and beloved Christmas custom to listen to this story. Tonight, this fourth annual presentation is brought to you with the sincere wish that your Christmas may be a happy one, and with the hope that the retelling of A Christmas Carol may help to make it so. And it is more than that, for with this Christmas present to you, Campbell's say thank you for your purchases of Campbell's soup throughout the month gone by. At the Christmas season, this becomes especially manifest. Everywhere, grocers see their shelves of Campbell's soups dwindle more rapidly now than at any other time of the year. It used to be thought that the demand increased in preparation for the Christmas feast, but really it isn't that alone. Women like to have plenty of good soups on hand all through the holidays so that they can serve piping hot, nourishing platefuls at any family mealtime. The youngsters are on the go all day long, making the most of the Christmas vacation, and soup can be ready for them in a jiffy. There's health and happiness in good hot soup. Your grocer has Campbell's soups, 21 delicious kinds, awaiting your selection. <laughs> 